2,000-year-old ritual taking place today. The nails are driven in, the man grimaces in pain. These penitents have chosen to reenact the sufferings of Christ in an attempt to atone for their sins or to ask for help from God. The village of San Pedro Couture in the north of the Philippines has been the site of crucifixions every Good Friday for the past 40 years. The men stay on the cross for up to 10 minutes in the scorching heat, four-inch nails deep in their hands. So far, there have been apparently no serious injuries. This is the 13th crucifixion for Heresito Sangalang, who vowed to go through the annual ritual 15 times after his mother was cured of tuberculosis. Elsewhere in the village, scores of penitents, including children, observe Good Friday by walking barefoot, beating their bare backs with beaded ropes and pieces of wood. After making shallow cuts in their backs with shards of glass, the men thrash themselves, splashing the onlookers with blood. The annual event draws a huge crowd, and many cannot understand the extremes to which these Catholics will go. I'm not sure if it's because of faith or machismo or maybe a little bit ego or what. It's, it's difficult for me to understand. The Roman Catholic Church officially disapproves of this primitive display of religious faith, but they have done little to discourage it. The event is so entrenched in the Philippine culture, it seems set to continue for many years.